Thank you, Jack Russell Band. Appreciate you guys. Sanders, I don't do this anymore. It is very rare that I ever go out anymore. I don't mean go out, but singing and shit. But I want to address the elephant in the room. Not you, sir. No, it's not cool. That's body shaming. I don't do that. I'm talking about licensing, song licensing. And sometimes we're not going to take it. I want to rock two of the most licensed songs of the 80s. And sometimes it's cool when it's Iron Eagle. Remember, we're not going to take it in Iron Eagle back in the 80s. Or, or I want to rock in Road Trip. You remember, I want to rock in Road Trip. Or Steven Spielberg, Ready Player One. We're not going to take it. The big fucking finish. Sometimes it's cool. And sometimes it's a little fucking embarrassing. And right now I'm going to talk about I want to talk about a pretty embarrassing moment and explain. Because I got a call one day that said a pharmaceutical company wanted to use, we're not going to take it, my song for a big commercial campaign and they're going to pay me $300,000. And I was like, fuck yes, fuck yes. I said, what does it do? He said, it's a woman's premenopausal medication. That was my reaction, exactly. I said, a fucking woman's premenopausal medication. This is my fucking legacy, man. He said, D, it's $300,000. I was like, yes, I can. All right, all right, all right. What does this medication do? He says, well, it helps with hot flashes. It reduces hair loss. And it stops vaginal dryness. Did you just say... It stops vaginal dryness? Yeah. Well then, I'm doing fucking God's work, ain't I? Because everybody's against vaginal dryness. Show of hands, who's against vaginal dryness? Alright, you didn't raise your hand. I give you about 10 more years, you will be shooting dust out of that thing. You'll be begging for this shit. It's coming. It's... That's a fucking true story, by the way. I swear to fucking God. D. Snyder fights vaginal dryness. And why do I bring this up? Because this next song was used by SpongeBob SquarePants. And they changed the words to Goofy Google Rock. It was a half million dollars, but still, this one is called I Want to Rock!
try to play this game now. And I have a feeling I am dealing with party professionals. I don't know, I don't got to explain to you how to play the I Want to Rock game. So let's try it one time. You see, you see, warriors, you see these motherfuckers, oh, they know what's going on. Let's try it again. I want to rock, rock. All right, just one, one, one word. If you have a light to live directly on you, to not enough sub motion guy, right there guy, that girl there, that guy there, and you got a light on you, you got an obligation to get fucking crazier than the other motherfuckers. Do it again. I want to rock. I think they're ready. You know what they're ready for, boys? This is a special crowd. I shit you not. They are ready for full-on, old-school, Iron Maiden, Feet on the monitor. Get your foot up there. Get a foot on that monitor. Now take that guitar and point it at the audience like it's a penis. And slowly.